Hello, it's January 13th, and it's time for another anime DVD update. So for this week, there weren't a lot of anime DVDs that came out. But fortunately, um, they were all new, so I have them all here. I hate these duck, these boxes so weird sometimes. Again, this is one of these things in the thing. Y'all don't need my receipt. First up, we have Naruto Shippuden DVD 5. And I think the box set is slated to come out next week or the week after. Real soon, either way. Huh. Something loose in here. This is Ghost in the Shell 2.0. I don't know a whole lot about what is different about this, so I'll probably have to check it out. And, in my opinion, the most interesting release this week, Hidamari Sketch. Season 1. 12 episodes plus 2 OVAs. Most interesting simply because it's a new anime and I love starting new anime. So, next up, let's cover other things that arrived during the week. You all may have remembered that um, Vampire Princess Mew was supposed to arrive. It never did. I mean, it hasn't yet. It still has till the 22nd before it comes late. Let's start covering these. Um, Genshin 2 DVD 3 finally came in. I haven't even taken it out of its plastic yet. Um, Gundam Seed Movie 1 Empty Battlefield. It's kind of hard to read it and see it because it's shiny. That would be the first movie. This would be the Gundam Seed second movie, The Far Away Dawn. An interesting thing about these is there's nothing on them that specifically says they are movies, as far as I can tell. Other than the uh, wrapping itself, that's going to be taken off. Um, next up, we have uh, Gunbuster 2 DVD 1. DVD 2 and DVD 3 and I've actually had a chance to watch this and that was pretty damn cool it kind of felt like um, something a bit more crazy than FLCL but not quite as crazy as Gurren Lagann so it, it was exciting but uh, before I watched that I dug a uh, Gunbuster out of my collection and watch that. At first I didn't think you needed to do that because it was hard to tell how this was even related to that but by the end of the series I mean it's a short six episode series but by the end of this series you could tell. So if you're interested in checking out Gunbuster 2 maybe you don't have to see the original Gunbuster but I suggest it. Uh, and then finally we have um, Armitage 3. I think this is the OVA. 140 minutes could be. Arm is this actually pronounced Armitage the third? I don't know. This one would be the Polymatrix movie, I guess. I'm not entirely sure. I need to watch it and find out. And then finally, I also got Armitage Dual Matrix. This is... This one didn't come on its own, though. It uh, actually came in... This lunchbox. Or this metal tin. And inside of it, there was some styrofoam to keep things from moving around. And this box for the anime figurine that came with it. And 
This would be the anime figurine that came with it. Let's see. I haven't quite figured out what I'm supposed to do with this. These are some handcuffs that came with her. It's a bit strange of a figurine. I mean, the um, limbs actually are um, not solid, so it's not a just stand there. The legs were flexible, so she didn't quite stand perfectly on her base when she came out. The handgun, you can put in her hand, so I'm guess my guess has been that the um, handcuffs are an alternative to that. And then her uh, glasses also didn't come on her. Very strange. Well, that would be this week's anime DVD update. I think next week... As if everything comes out on time, we should have a very big update without me resorting to buying old stuff. So, see y'all then.